Hi, my name is Jean. Welcome to Johnny's Workshop. Today we'll be looking to this Ferrari 250 GTO by Superslot or Scalectrix in the UK. It's a very nice looking car. The reason why I'm showing this today is because it's a front motor and it's a digital setup. So here we are. As you can see, there are lots of wires around. That's because it's got lights. And well, this car is set up so you can race uh, in a Kinrara. You will notice the certain things have been glued here like all the bushings. That's good practice on scale electrics to do that because they come out loose over time. And the, and the retro chip fits right underneath the shaft. Weight wise, uh, well, there are different arrangements you can do here, but the way that worked for me is to put weight at the back only because there's so much weight at the front with the motor. The tires are the original. Uh, I found it really difficult to get uh, tires of this size in the width at the moment. It's just right to race in Kinrara, which is what this setup is about. With lights, the width of the wheels and, and tires and diameter, etc. And when you're going to when you're going to do this setup something to take into account you need to trim the chassis quite a bit to allow the body roll and you will see that normally you get some some sort of pegs here that will fit in the body they will you know fit there but to allow the body roll you need to cut them off and i can't remember if there wasn't any at the back but i definitely definitely had to to scrape all the edges to allow uh, you know a decent body roll so the LED sits right in front of the motor here and it's such a tight fit that I had to cut some of the the interior to allow room for the the capacitor here to merge, but arguably you could you know to make it tidier you could glue another piece of plastic to hide away the you know the chip because as it is you will be able to see it. But it's no big deal, you can hardly see it. Thank you all for watching. I hope this video was useful to anyone. And see you next time.